Hello, Internet. Nick Livingston here. Let's talk about MLB 14, the show, and our brand new game mode, Community Challenges. We've built a tool that allows you to create custom challenges and share them with the community. The result will be a huge variety of bite-sized game sessions that test your abilities in a competitive social setting. The best way to understand Community Challenges is to play a challenge, so let's quickly run through it. The Browse Challenges screen features a list that constantly updates with trending content. Filters allow us to narrow our search based on our preferences. Challenges have icons that give us info about them. This one is repeating, meaning we'll be attempting the same game situation over and over. It also has an auto hit dialed in, which tells us we're on defense and we'll always see the exact same hit. To succeed, we must rob three home runs in 10 attempts. For the purposes of time, we've quickly cut together my successes and my friend Ramon's failures. No thanks to Ramon, we have succeeded at this challenge. Do we recommend this challenge? Oh yeah. These votes factor into what challenges are featured in the trending list we were browsing earlier. Yay! We won stuff! We're also on the leaderboard. Each challenge has its own dedicated leaderboard with a stubs bonus going to the top scorer each week. This creates a very personal sense of competition when jockeying for leaderboard spots. When it comes to content, the fact is many of you are just as capable at creating compelling stuff as we are. We just needed to deliver the tools. With community challenges, you and the devs will use the same in-game tools to create content. So let's go check out how simple it was to make the home run robbing challenge we just attempted. For this challenge, we're going to use the default rosters but custom rosters with custom players make for some very interesting possibilities. Before getting into the Create Challenge tool, we lock in our team's uniforms and stadium. This challenge repeats a custom situation as opposed to having the game progress normally. Now we reach the main setup page. The left side shows your custom game situations. Let's jump right in and set up the situation. We go with 10 attempts as the length for this situation, ninth inning, down by one, Miggy up to bat, runners on. Using an auto hit, we move the ribbon and lock in Miggy's towering drive. It is possible to have multiple situations play in sequence, but for this challenge, we only need the one. So let's move on. The right side is where you set up your global set of goals, disqualifiers, and custom challenge settings. By the end of this challenge, in order to succeed, we want you to rob the home run three times. So we'll set three putouts as the goal. Since it's at the top of the list, it also acts as the ranked stat in the dedicated leaderboard. In this challenge, there are no disqualifiers, which are stats that would result in instant failure. Also, no custom settings or sliders, which would lock specific options to this challenge. Step two of creating a challenge is determining what amount of risk and reward you want to add to your challenge. It also explains how you, as the challenge creator, Stand to earn stubs every time someone attempts your challenge. In the third and final step, we name, describe, and tag our challenge. Then we must prove ourselves by succeeding at the challenge we've just created. This is the final requirement before publishing our challenge to the public and telling all our friends to play it. That's it for this preview of Community Challenges. So, go pre-order your copy of MLB 14 The Show to start thinking about which challenges are going to take you to the top of the featured list. Thanks for watching. PlayStation.